What's going on, Infinite Fam? Welcome back to another video. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, turn on your post notification bell, leave a positive comment down below for a chance to get a what? For a chance to win a shout out in the next video. Now, I'm just gonna say this right now. I'm going through all these DMs, I guess is what you would call them. Y'all some nasty. Y'all real nasty. And y'all a little weird too. Like, actually, y'all a lot of weird. Like, right. Like, I don't even wanna know. I didn't need to know this stuff, but I mean, that's the purpose of today's video. As you guys can tell, I said my thumbnail of the video. We we are basically going to be reacting to your dirty confessions. We put a post up on Instagram telling us to tell us your confessions and we're going to be reading them off. I got, strangely, I got less crazy ones than Janice. Janice got all the nasty, weird ones. I don't know why, maybe because he's nasty and weird. I'm not nasty or weird, bye. Nasty, all of them, that's all I'm gonna say. I'm gonna read the first one, here we go, right? I just went to my cousin's place to take a bath and I came back home hella tipsy. That don't sound right. I came. What the hell? I went to my cousin's place to take a bath and came back tipsy. Picture that. That's, that's not a little okay. Weird. They that's, didn't say anything. That's just a little like. Uh, what, what, why'd you come back home tipsy? Obviously, you was drinking alcohol, but it's like, why? And why you gotta go to your cousin's house to take a bath? And why it gotta be a bath? Why can't it be a shower? Okay, I don't even know. Think about that. What they doing with their cousin in the in the bathtub? All oh, right. This one just made me feel uncomfortable. I kind of wanted to block the person. I sniff my brother's underwear almost every night, but we're both straight, but he doesn't know about it. Ew! Bro, <laughs> why? And I, I, I hope they're clean at least. I hope they're clean underwear. Ew, I, I don't think that that's what they do. That's just nasty, bro. That's why? That, just makes, that makes me feel uncomfortable. Yeah, me too. Oh my god. I just did it with my stepbrother after we did the TikTok of randomly hugging your siblings. I feel like I feel like y'all lying. Like some of these are just made up, I feel. I don't think so, because there's think about the world we live in. That's very true. There's some nasty people out here. I don't know. I'd like to think that these are just jokes. But like, if these are real, then this world is more scary than I, I thought it was. Bro, this next one. My cousin kissed me on the lips. Ah. Imagine kissing your cousin on the lips. That's disgusting. Well, how would you react to that if your cousin, nah, if you, if your nothing, cousin kissed you on the lips? Not for nothing. I know that's a normal thing in like some house. Kissing on the lips, your cousin? Yes, I've seen it in like real life, and I'm like, what the hell? All I'm gonna say is if my cousin kisses me on the lips, I'm straight gonna punch him or her in the face. Right. Don't kiss me on the lips if you're my cousin, bro. I don't- That's we, gross. We don't do that in my family. If you and my family, you know we don't do that. So if you do it, you're gonna get punched in the face. <laughs> I drove a car and almost hit and killed someone when I was eight. And then they put the, the emoji of like the moon smiling. You're, you're proud of that. You oh almost, my goodness. I'm not gonna lie, that's kind of gangster though. No, think about it, it think about not. it, yo, you're eight years old, you just took a car and then you almost, you, well, you did hit and almost killed someone. You live in GTA in real life. That's not That's okay. gangster. That's probably where they got it from, GTA. They're like, oh, let me go steal a car. I kind of want to reply back and be like, yo, what do you do for a living today? <laughs> like, you, you must be on some shit. All right, I think this is my last, like, good one. I had sex with my cousin's best friend while they were taking a dookie. That is trifling. I'm not, wait, I had some my cousin's best friend while they're, I mean, that's not bad. I mean, if your cousin walks out, they go to use the bathroom and you're over here doing it with their best friend. That's not necessarily nasty or anything like that. Like, no, that's just trifling. Like, I think that's just wrong. Like you're doing it behind your cousin. Up. Yeah, that's, that's kind of grimy in a way, but I mean, at least it ain't a relative. Uh, yeah, at least it's not like just, dirty in that way. That's just gross. But I mean, those are really like all the good ones that I have, I guess. You got the crazy one, so let's hear it. All right, so let me start off with this one. I slept with my ex's brother after he cheated on me. Was I wrong? Slept with my ex's brother when he cheated? Hell no, nah, you ain't wrong. I feel nah. like that's just very petty wop of you. How? Uh, I mean... I, I can see, I can see, I can see why, but yo, the, the, if they got cheated on, they ain't no feelings anymore, like, I'm gonna, I guess it's petty, yeah, but it's I, petty, exactly. I, you ain't cause wrong you for petty, that, cause you petty, cause you petty, that's why you don't see nothing you wrong, ain't wrong for it. that. you ain't wrong for that, I, I get even with people, I don't, I don't let them be on top of me, I let them, I get even. I touch myself in the bathroom to my boyfriend's picture while my parents were around. Why wouldn't you just wait till later at night and you guys can be freaks when your parents were asleep? I don't know, because maybe they were too young, like, to be with their boyfriend or whatever the case may be. I mean, I guess. I. 
if they're sneaking around, it's obviously for a reason. They're probably too young. This person looks very young. I don't so. see. Well, that's not anything bad, I guess. I mean, I guess that's a normal relationship, kind of. Like, I don't know. You're, you're. I guess. You're pleasuring yourself to your significant other. I, I don't know. I, I don't see anything wrong with that. I think they see something wrong with it because they're not allowed to, obviously. So oh, if they're not allowed. Something wrong. I don't, I don't know. All right. Next one is. I once had sex in the water at a public beach and a kid was like 15 feet away. Oh, come on. You got salt water all up in there? Ew. I feel bad for her. Bro, hold on. Think about it. Hear me out. Hear me out. Salt water in the ocean, the salt is really whale sperm, right? Imagine if a girl went into the water and got pregnant by a whale. I'm done. Anyway. Yo, imagine the size of her belly. Oh, my God. That's Yo. not gonna happen. No. No. I said imagine. The no. key word there was imagine. I can't. Someone said I had a sexual dream about my best friend. Nah, that's just weird, bro. You're gonna ruin the friendship. That's what I'm saying. You're ruining that friendship right there, bro. That's just, it's a little weird. I followed my girlfriend to see if she lied about going to work and she never goes to work. Damn. She Yo. Collect Yo, she's collecting unemployment. <laughs> and she getting the D. Dang, bro. Yo, dump her. Dump her. That's it. She for the streets. That's it, bro. This next person said, this young man was doing my best friend dirty, so I spit in some water and I served it to him. So wow. I'm assuming that they're like a waitress or something like that, or like work at like a fast food place. Wow. And they came and they did that. See? This is why I would be trusting going to like fast food places or like restaurants, especially if I know somebody. Bro, I'm all for getting back at someone, like getting revenge, but that's just nasty. Yeah, like, that's, you just don't do shit That's like just that. wrong. And you could have got fired if you got caught. You know what I'm like? It, it ain't worth that. It ain't worth getting fired. Yeah, that's gross. I don't, I don't like that. I started dating four guys at a single time and ended up being with one for one and a half years. P.S. He never knew this. Damn. What the hell? Yo, the ultimate, like, I don't even, how would you call that ultimate, like, sneaky link? That is bad. Like, Yo, but think, oh you gotta give them God. credit. Give them credit. They kept that on the low for a year and a half. Why would I be giving credit to that? Bro, because that's four people. That's four different people you hid secrets from. You, so you think that's that's funny? You think that, that's no, funny? that's impressive. Oh, that's impressive. Oh, sh Janice, come on. I don't think it's them. It's them, not me. No, because you, your opinion on this is like... Janice, it's impressive. You just hid a secret from four different people while you were messing with all four different people. And you're still with one of them. That's fucking crazy. I don't know how I feel about your reactions to these, to be honest. I feel like I did. I mean, you acting like you, you're you impressed, like you want to do it. Yo, because people can't even cheat with one other person, yet alone three extra ones to make four. Like, yo, you have to be on some sneaky link stuff right there. That's impressive. My next one is, I got a BJ from this girl at a metal show in the mosh pit, and we got kicked out. And then the emojis they, they put... With the with the ghost, <laughs> Bruh, hold on. You got a BJ in a mosh pit. That's kind of tight. Yeah, until someone bites something off, and bro, nah. Think about it. Think about how crazy mosh pits get. People be coming out of there missing teeth and stuff. That's true. Imagine someone punches them like, or punches the girl like while she's like. Think about it. There's so many things that could have gone wrong. This gonna be like. Bleh! No, nah, not even that. What if she would have like clenched and like ripped it? Nah, oh, come on, bro. I don't know. Well, at least at least that didn't happen. Bro, that's just. I don't know, man. I don't know. All right, and my last one is I once did it in a changing room. Mm. I mean, that's not that bad. Yeah, that's not too bad. I can. That's kind of exciting. Oh, someone just DM me this one. What? I. Oh! <laughs> I gave a BJ in school and there were cameras right in front of us. You just don't care. You just want everybody to, to know that you did what you I did. I know that video went viral and I know you got expelled. And I know that that messed up your reputation. Bruh, y'all really just don't care. Y'all no, really out here just doing it. Like, that's Gen Z for you, I feel. Nah, bro, because the people, nah, bro, because the people that I got messages from, they was like grown adults too. Mm, people so is weird out here, man. People is just weird in general. And one of the grown people was the one with the cousin. 
Uh uh. I'm telling you, bro, people are weird out in this world, yo. I, I, I need some more good ones. If you guys want to see a part two to this, because this was actually low key funny. <laughs> if you guys want to see a part two, make sure you guys follow us on Instagram. Let us know you guys want a part two. We'll do a confessions part two, you know, reacting to them. And we're going to pick out the craziest ones. And don't lie either, just to make it sound good or sound crazy. Like, I want to know you have true, dirty confessions. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you guys did, don't forget to smash that like button and comment. What? Anyway, if you guys are. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, if you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure you guys smash that thumbs up button. Comment down below if you guys want to see a part two or anything like that. It is time for today's post notification shout out. Today's post notification shout out goes out to Cody Reynolds. Shout out to you, bro. Thank you so much for your love and support. If you guys want a post notification shout out, all you guys got to do is like, comment, share, subscribe, and turn your post notification bells on so you're notified whenever we post a new video. That is right, guys. With all that being said, y'all nasty as hell. I'll see you on the next <laughs> video. Mm.